What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we'll be doing an NFL mock draft for the first round. Here we go. For the first pick, I think the Cincinnati Bengals will pick Joe Burrow. He's the best quarterback in the draft, and they need a quarterback. It's a no-brainer for the Bengals. With the second pick, I think the Washington Redskins are going to select Chase Young. They obviously need a big boost on defense, and Chase Young is the best way to go. With the third pick, I think the Lions are going to select Isaiah Simmons because he's obviously one of the top linebackers in the draft, and they need a good linebacker for their defense. With the fourth pick, I think the Giants are going to select Jeff Okuda. He's the top cornerback in the draft, and they really need help in their secondary. With the fifth pick, I think the Dolphins are going to pick Tua Tango Viola because he's the second best quarterback in the draft, and they really need a quarterback. With the sixth pick, I think the Chargers are going to select Derek Brown. He's a good defensive lineman to pair with Joey Bosa, and then they can have a dominant defensive line. With the seventh pick, I think the Panthers are going to select C.D. Lamb. I think he's a good receiver to pair with their receiver core. With the eighth pick, I think the Cardinals are going to select Jedrick Willis Jr. He's a good offensive line, and they need more protection around Kyler Murray. With the ninth pick, I think the Jaguars are going to select Jerry Judy. I think they need another top receiver to go with their core. With the tenth pick, I think the Browns are going to select Mekhi Becton. I think they need more protection around Baker Mayfield, and that's why I thought of this. With the 11th pick, I think the Jets are going to select Henry Ruggs III. I think he would be a great receiver to go with their core. With the 12th pick, I think the Raiders are going to select Clavon Chason. They need another edge ever since Khalil Mack left, and their defense just needs a boost. With the 13th pick, I think the 49ers are going to select Andrew Thomas. They always need more protection around Jimmy Garoppolo. With the 14th pick, I think the Bucks are going to select T. Higgins. I think he's a good receiver they can pair with uh, Mike Evans. The 15th pick, I think the Broncos are going to select Xavier McKinney. They could always use another star safety. The 16th pick, I think the Falcons are going to select CJ Henderson. I think we need another corner. Since Desmond Kurfant left in free agency, we need another star corner. With the 17th pick, I think the Cowboys are going to select Trayvon Diggs. They could always use a spare player on defense, with a bunch of their players always being injured all the time. With the 18th pick, I think the Dolphins are going to select AJ Epinesa. I think that's a good grab. Ever since they let Minka Fitzpatrick go to the Steelers, I think it's a good replacement and a solid defender. With the 19th pick, I think the Raiders are going to select Jonathan Taylor. The Raiders could always use a spare star running back, and it, I think it would really help their offense. With the 20th pick, I think the Jaguars are going to select Justin Herbert. I think he was a little overhyped in college. I don't think he'll go in the top 10. I think he'll go more of late first round. With the 21st pick, I think the Eagles are going to select Tristan Wirfs. I think they could always use a spare offensive lineman to guard Carson Wentz. With the 22nd pick, I think the Vikings are going to select Javon Kinlaw. I think it's a good defender and it'll help well round their defense. With the 23rd pick, I think the Patriots are going to select Jordan Love. They really need a quarterback ever since Brady left, and I don't think Brian Hoyer is going to cut it, so I think they're going to pick him. With the 24th pick, I think the Saints are going to select Eater Gross Matos. I think that's a really good pickup for them and a solid defender all around. With the 25th pick, I think the Vikings are going to select Grand Delpit. They always need to spare safety. It seems like their Vi the Vikings defense just needs help all around. Maybe this will give them a boost. With the 26th pick, I think the Dolphins are going to select Christian Fulton. They always lack um, defense in the secondary, and I think this will be a good pickup for them. With the 27th pick, I think the Seahawks are going to select Kenneth Murray. I think it will be a great pickup for them, and it would really boost their defense. With the 28th pick, I think the Ravens are going to select J.K. Dobbins. I feel like that's a good running back for them to pick up, and he would really fit their offense. With the 29th pick, I think the Titans are going to select Neville Gallimore. I think that will be a great pickup for their defensive line, and hopefully it will boost them up. With the 30th pick, I think the Packers are going to select Josh Jones. I feel like they always need more protection around Aaron Rodgers. With the 31st pick, I think the 49ers are going to select A.J. Terrell. I think they could always use a spare cornerback, and this would be a great pickup for them. With the 32nd pick, I think the Kansas City Chiefs are going to select Ross Blacklock. I feel like that's a good defensive lineman that they can pick up. Thanks for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.